Hey, MB Crew, Mona B here. You already know what to do. Turn on those post notifications and follow me on Instagram at Mona X Banks. So today I'm coming with something a little different, more of a lifestyle type of video. So we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it. I feel like I haven't done one of these videos in like so long. And yeah, so we're gonna get into it. So I have on this new gloss. It literally looks like my skin, skin tone, which is weird, but I got it on now. I'm not taking it off. So anyway, so for my birthday, as you guys know, I'm, my birthday was this past September, if you do not know. And so I got a vanity for my birthday. My mom gifted me a vanity. And this is just what it looks like. I absolutely love it. Um, let me just show it to y'all. So this is the vanity. It has the lights. It has the clear top where you can see through the drawers. And then it has the little crystal knobs, as you guys can see. It has the crystal knobs. Super cute. So this is what it looks like with the lights on. And then I'm going to show y'all with the lights off. So this is it with the lights off. So this is it with the lights on. So I'm going to talk to you guys about what this particular video is going to be about. For today, so I got this vanity back in September and I have yet done anything to it. I actually need to get a chair for it, so I'll probably go out this week or next week to get a chair for it. And I ordered a few things off of Amazon, a few organizational things off of Amazon because I don't want the vanity to be cluttered. Now, as far as the top drawers, as you guys can see, they're clear. I was thinking about eventually getting some mirror cut so they won't be clear. But then again, I don't know. So what I'm probably gonna do is I'm probably just gonna get like some silk fabric from the fabric store. I haven't decided like what color. Probably like a neutral tone. Um, Cause my studio is kind of like earthy. It has like the wicker baskets and everything. So I'll probably just go with like a silk underlay. And then I'll put like my, I guess like my high end makeup on the top. Um, but, I have, <clears throat> me, but I haven't quite gotten that far yet. But I did order a few things off of Amazon, um, and they should be here over the next couple of days, which will be good because I want my top of my vanity to look nice. I don't want it to look clutter cluttered. Like in the past, I've had makeshift vanities, like which is nothing wrong with like the IKEA vanities that you build yourself. But I was just like so over those, and I have been talking about for so long how I've been wanting a vanity because I've never had like a real vanity. I've always like used a desk or like made one like from the drawers and stuff from IKEA. So I'm really excited about this vanity. I wasn't going to do a whole lot to listen because a lot of things are going to be changing in my life coming with the new year and everything. But I was like, well, I have it right now. I'm in this space. I might as well just go ahead and decorate it. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, not so much the top today. I have these clear organizers that I'm going to be putting in the drawers. And I threw away all of my makeup, you guys. Literally, before my birthday, I trashed all of my makeup. Um, This is pretty much all the makeup I have in this bag right here. This is, like, literally my makeup collection. I have a little bit of makeup back there on those shelves um, that I'll be going through with y'all on this video. But this is pretty much what I use every single day. So I don't really have any makeup, y'all. I literally threw away all my makeup. I just felt like I wanted to just start over. It was like, I just wanted to get in with the new out with the old and with the new and that's like the whole theme i feel like for this upcoming year for my life i'm just gonna be like making a lot of changes and shifting a lot of things and you guys i'm gonna bring you guys along for the ride but a lot is gonna be changing with me um just i want you know you just want better for yourself new things i just need like fresh and new I need freshness in my life but i did go to sephora recently like a few days ago so i am going to show you guys the stuff that I got from Sephora as well. But first, I'm going to go ahead and line these drawers. Um, I'm just going to use this white liner simply because I have clear organizers and I thought that would look nice. At first, I was going to get printed. Ooh. At first, I was going to get printed liner, but then I was like, nah, I don't think I'm going to like that. So that's what I'm about to get into and y'all going to get to watch me do it. So I'm going to line these drawers. Let me show y'all. So I'm going to literally line the drawers with this liner. I'm going to cut it and everything. I'm going to line them. And once I line them and everything, I will be back. I 
can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. See, we was cool right before I hit the fence. But he hit the fan when I got him down and pinched. When I took a break, I had to leave and go get cleansed. God forgive me for all my sins. I can't say these hoes, cause my last name ain't Kent. Cooking on the stove, that's the way he paid the rent. Working on the pole, that's the way she pays the wish. Better watch your soul, cause you know they trying to get it. Yeah, yeah. I learned my right from wrong on a song. I let my heart bleed on my sleeve through microphones. I'm trying to write my wrongs. By writing out my wrongs. Ran through a check, cause it's hard to live off bread alone. So if you see me slipping, yeah, yeah, let me know. Cause it ain't the end of times yet. I know, but it's getting close. Yeah, I need my space to breathe. Yeah, so I've lined the drawers. So this is what they look like. It kind of comes up on the side because I didn't cut them because the width is longer. But I don't mind it coming up on the side simply because I'm messy and I can see myself now picking something up and like scraping the side. So at least this won't be completely filthy um, from the makeup. Which I know makeup is messy, so I don't really mind that. So I went ahead and lined all of these drawers. Um, I could have cut them smaller. I feel like the drawers on the bottom are bigger. Um, and then on this side, see, these are the drawers that you're going to see through. So I'm going to get fabric for these. And then this one just has a shelf in it. So I was going to, I had bought some more of these because the man that put it together, like, I don't know what the heck happened. And, um, he took them when he left and I was like, what the heck? He didn't even say anything. So that was like annoying. So I had bought these, but I decided that I'm not even going to use it because I have an extra shelf over here, which is good just in case this shelf gets damaged. You can fit another shelf in here, but it's just kind of crammed. I don't really like that. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to line this top drawer in this bottom drawer and call it a day. So, y'all, I'm going to have to buy some more liner because this is the last of it because I, I had I already had this liner. I didn't go specifically buy any. Um... For this but this piece actually fits on the top so that's good I haven't decided what I'm gonna put in here to be honest yet I don't really know I was thinking maybe my nail polish stuff but truthfully I do not know so I'm just gonna leave that there for now and I'm gonna buy some more liner I got these got these organizers from Amazon so I'm gonna see which ones I'm gonna use on here. I'll link them below if you guys are interested or need organizers, but they're just these clear acrylic organizers. You can use these for anything. They're not specifically for vanities, but I got them for my vanity. So they have these little ones, which is cool. Then they have like these longer ones. So I'm thinking I'm going to put like my um, lip liners and stuff in, in these. And then we have... Oh, they have the little gripper pads. Oh, they come with extra ones just in case these ones get damaged. Hopefully, I can see it. But, um, yeah. So, have these. And then it came with one this size, a rectangle one. So, basically, what I'm going to do is try to figure out how I want to set this up. And put, like, my face, like, the stuff that I use every day up here. That's what I'm thinking, but y'all see it's clear. So that's why I wanted the base to be still white so you can see through. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put those two big ones and I'm going to put my foundations and powders and concealers. Because that's what I grab for on a regular basis. And then on the next one, I think I'm going to put my lip product. Why be going ghost? I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road. Because I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let him take my soul. Nah, 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 no. They thinking I'm bluffing, but I promise I do it. That K got a drum, like murder and booming. We sending you verb if I get my little Uzi. They thinking I'm crazy, I'm gonna see you to hate this. People I'm saying, get what I'm painting. A picture big, I call it little baby. If I'm on the board, then we plan chess. If you on my way, you gon' need a vest. Act big, you might get stretched. All your gun talk, I ain't impressed. My 45 seen real traffic. That's Dallas, Texas. My little partner called a body four miles of riding. He told him get about the car, hit him with the shotty. Well, this case is like some of my miscellaneous makeup that I have. I've had this for so long, it's cracked, and I'm gonna get rid of it. So 
I have a bunch of powders down here that I've not used. So I think I'm going to make one of these drawers like stuff that's new that hasn't moved up. So I guess that's what I'll do. I just want to put stuff in here that I know I'm going to reach for like every day. Didn't even realize I had a new foundation. I really love CoverGirl foundation. So I'm going to put that there. Put my eyebrow stuff down there. This I love this concealer. This is new, but I'm still just going to put it up top because the one I have right there is running low anyway. That 12th gauge gave him life in the 12th grade. I tried to write him, but we ain't on the same page. I caught him slipping. I just had to let him know. It ain't the end of times yet. I know, but it's getting close. These demons really had to get you, so you better guard your post. There's certain things I could probably let go, but I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. I can't let them take my soul. Okay, so this was my Rihanna. This broke me out, so I never really wore it because the first time I wore it, it broke me out and it's old, so tossing that. I'm still getting rid of makeup, as y'all can see. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to finish the top another day because obviously I got to get the rest of the stuff, but I just put just my wipes in there, this setting spray, and then here's my top drawer. These drawers go back really deep, so I like that. So that's the foundation that I currently have. I put foundations in the back, setting powders, concealers up top, setting spray, eyelash glue, you know, all that little stuff. Told y'all I threw out all my makeup. I'm going to put my beauty blenders in here. Um, Yeah, I'm going to put my beauty blenders in this little one. You know, got mascara, my little tools, tweezers, my palette um contour palette all of that sorry i'm shaking a lot but and then in this drawer i did my blush and stuff is back here because i don't really wear this stuff every single day but i do wear it from time to time so my lip glosses i turned this around um lip liner and then right now this is just kind of like miscellaneous and then this is empty too, so I'm going to eventually fill this up, obviously, over time. I'm thinking I'm going to put lashes down here. No, actually, I'm going to put lashes up here. Um, Something in the middle of here, I'm not sure yet. And lipstick on this side, because I have my MAC lipsticks and stuff that I need to, you know, get nice. Like, make them nice. I'm going to, um, I got to get some new organizers for them. So, this is a project. Clearly, because I'm rebuilding my makeup collection because I threw it all out. But, anywho, hopefully it's not too dark, y'all. I'm sorry. It's Y'all know it gets dark early. And that's another thing I'm going to be doing is getting better lighting for my studio because it is dark in here. Yeah, so I'm going to be getting some lighting over the next couple of weeks. So, as y'all can see, I pretty much emptied this. I don't know if I'm going to eventually change this out because I'm kind of tired of it being in the background of my videos. But I haven't quite figured out if I want to just put my backdrop back up or what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to figure that out at a later date. But anywho, went to Sephora um, a few days ago and got some items. So, I'm going to go through them with y'all. So, I got a new beauty blender. I haven't had a beauty blender in a while because the Real Technique ones work just as good. But this green one was cute. So, Got the green one. The Their Real Mascara by Benefit. I love this. Um, I haven't had this in a while, but it's one of my favorites. The thing about high-end makeup, I don't really buy high-end makeup like I used to simply because I used to work at JCPenney's, and y'all know how JCPenney's in Sephora, and that's when I used to buy high-end makeup because I get 25% off. But drugstore makeup does just as good as high-end makeup, and high-end makeup to me is really overpriced. Like... It is ridiculous how they be getting down, but it is what it is. So I got the um, Uncensored Lipstick by Rihanna. I've n I haven't tried this. I usually use the one by Lip Bar. I, like, I really like the red one by Lip Bar a lot. But I hear a lot of people rant and rave about the Rihanna one, so I will be trying this out. And yeah, I don't wear red lipstick a whole lot, but... When I do, I want to pop out and look good. Okay? So, I guess we might as well stay on lip colors. So, I got quite a few lip colors. I got this Kat Von D. I love Kat Von D lip colors. 
Um, I used to wear, what was the one? The Lolita, I believe. That was like, remember when that came out, y'all? That was so popular. If you're into makeup, you know what I'm talking about. But I got the bow and arrow. So that's going to be really cute. It's like a nude. I really wear a lot of nude lips. I still like colored lips, but I don't really wear them as I, like I used to. Then from the Sephora blend, I blend from the Sephora brand, <laughs> I got this lip gloss in the color Blessed. I'm going to let y'all know how I like these. But this is in the color Blessed. And then this is their Ultra Lip Shine in the Sephora brand. And this is called the Perfect Nude. So I got those. I'm going to be you trying those out. I haven't used primer in so long. And I didn't even know that Sephora don't carry the Becca primer. So I'm going to probably have to go to Ulta and see if they carry it. Because I do like that primer. Um, My skin has changed a lot. But... I do like that primer. So, the lady at Sephora recommended the Makeup Forever Shine Control. And this is what it looks like. So, I'm going to try it. She says a little goes a long way. So, we'll see about that. We'll see about that. Useless Concealer by Tarte. I've never had a Tarte Concealer. But I was like, let me try it. I was in there. So, why not try it? I got it in a really light shade because I'm going to use it too contour but this is 50h um deep 50h deep so that's a that i haven't done a makeup haul in so long y'all like this feels so weird because i just haven't done one i don't know y'all let me know do y'all like makeup hauls well, i got a mini all-nighter setting spray because i got a lot of setting spray oh i have my favorite setting spray but i do really like this one i didn't get the big one because i probably only would use this when i go out because the one that i have because the thing about it is, y'all know I do a lot of tutorials and stuff like that. And I don't like to wear high-end makeup in my tutorials due to the fact that I'm going to literally wipe it off when the video is over. Ooh, excuse me, unless I have somewhere to go. But And then I also was looking for a new foundation. I've tried a lot of high-end foundations and none of them... I don't have a favorite one. Like I do like Clinique, so I definitely am going to grab some Clinique foundation. But the one of the workers at Sephora... She recommended the Giorgio Armani, so I got a mini one just to test it out. So this is what it looks like, and I got it in the color 14. It doesn't have a name. I just got it in 14. It is the Perfect Glow Flawless Foundation. She told me that a little goes a long way. It's luminous silk, but I do have, like, my skin isn't oily as it used to be, so that should work for me, hopefully. We'll see. And then I did run over to MAC and I got a chestnut lip liner OG. If you ain't got a chestnut lip liner as a brown girl, what are you doing? You need to get one. I had lost mine a while ago. I need to go back and get Night Moth. I don't know why I didn't get that while I was there, but whatever. So I'm going to put my new makeup in my vanity that I did get. My makeup brushes are in these containers, which they're completely filthy. I got enough, like two more of these. I ordered a makeup brush holder, so I will be transferring these into that. But I'm going to wash these first. So I'll probably do that tonight with some Dr. Bronner soap. And yes, you all. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. It was a start to me getting my makeup collection back on track. Because like I said, I threw away all of my makeup. I just felt like I had a lot of it. It was old. And I just needed to throw it out and start fresh. Because a lot of it was old. Like, it was ridiculous. And a lot of it was just... It just been through a lot. It was caked up, one right. Y'all know how that goes. So maybe this is a sign that you need to declutter your makeup, girl, <laughs> if you're watching this. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video like this. There will be more lifestyle videos to come. So I hope you guys are excited about them. I'm very excited about them. Show y'all a different side of me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments some of your favorite makeup, your favorite makeup products, your favorite brand. Because like I said, I am in the process of getting new makeup. So let me know some makeup that I need to try. And I will definitely get it. So let me know in the comments below. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye.